breaking news out of Texas, and it is heartbreaking. An active shooter situation has occurred. Three young children and a woman. California, Oklahoma, Virginia. An AR-15. A shooting. Another one. A teenage girl and a young woman died. We are once again talking about gun violence in America. In Uvalde, Texas, the seasons have passed. It's seven months since a gunman killed 19 young children and their two teachers. But here, time has not healed. Well, I remember in the hours after the shooting, these streets were packed with news crews from all around the world. It's quiet now. They've gone. They've moved on. But the school is still here. It's closed now. It'll be demolished. But all those reminders of such tragedy, they are all around. It does make you wonder how a community like this can ever really recover. There is a sadness here that will never recede. One home, one loss of so many. This American reality now so often feels tragically banal. But absorb the stories, look at the numbers. The scale is staggering and it's getting worse. We've taken a two week snapshot of America, the two weeks around Uvalde. The bigger the dot, the greater the number killed and injured. In two weeks, over 2,000 shootings. More than 800 people dead, over 1,700 injured. Not exceptional, normal. Because all over this country, strangers are bound by grief. 